Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Lot of iPhone users are reporting that their iPhone stuck on allow this device to access photos and video screen. Here I will show you how to fix this issue. Solution 1 is restart your iPhone. If you have iPhone 10 and later models, do the following steps to restart your device. Press and hold the side button and either volume up or down button until you see the slide to power off slider, then drag it to turn it off. Once you turn off your iPhone, wait for a few seconds and turn it back on. If you have iPhone 8 plus and earlier models, do the following steps to restart. Press and hold the side or power button until you see the slide to power off slider. Now drag it to turn off. Wait for a few seconds and turn it back on. You got the slide to power off slider screen. Still you got this pop up and could not turn off your device. Try the next solution. Solution 2 is first restart your iPhone. If you are using iPhone 8, 10, 11 and 12 series and iPhone SE second generation, do the following steps to first restart. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, do the following steps to first restart. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models, do the following steps to first restart. Press and hold the home button and side or power button at the same time until the Apple logo appears. Solution 3 is restore your iPhone via Finder or iTunes. First, connect your iPhone to Mac or PC via USB cable. If you have a Mac with macOS Catalina, open Finder. Or if you have a Mac with macOS Mojave or earlier or PC, open iTunes. Now locate your device on Mac or PC. While your device is connected, first restart your device until you get this recovery mode screen. Next you will get this pop up. Select restore. Now your computer will try to reinstall iOS without erasing your data. Your computer will download the software for your device. If it takes more than 15 minutes, your device will exit recovery mode. You have to force restart your device to get into recovery mode. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.